Hello, hello everyone. It's Becky and we are going to do our Marguerite Miller. Let me see. We need a repeating pattern, a tea bag cover. I'm not sure if they meant like the outer layer or this layer that went over the tea. Something that sits on the table, something soft, numbers written backwards, and as a bonus wrapping paper. So we're going to use this paper. We're going to get our page ready. Okay. And I'm thinking for a repeating pattern, we are going to use the security envelope, the inside of an envelope pattern page. So we're gonna use what one do we want to use? Let's just use this one. This looks like a good one. We'll just use this one. Then how do you get them out? Are they perforated? No, you just pull them out. Pull them out. Okay, I pulled one out. Okay. Just like straighten up our edge down here. Okay, we're gonna go to right there. you guys okay then we're just going to do a straight edge down there about like right like that ouch let's get us some glue I went and got the toenail cat toenail trimmer brush and Emma has left the building has left the room Um, 
Let's add it to the bottom. Okay, so here's our tea bag. I'm just going to I was thinking I would put my prompts on that, but Now I'm thinking maybe I'll just put it on the tea bag. Now I'm thinking I'm just going to cut. But since we buy the big boxes of tea, our tea bags do not have that outer cover on them. Well, you know what time it is, right? I'm going to get this little distress ink. Yeah, when I rearrange, I'm tired, I'm tired of moving everything just to get this. What do they mean by numbers written backwards? Do we start over here and go that way? Or do we flip the numbers around? this let's see how about if we put that up there where it covers that we'll put that like that so here's our something soft this piece of felt I'm going to take it, put it over there somewhere. Something on the table. Well, we have um, tablecloth. No, in a minute, okay? Okay. 
in a minute. I was busy. Bless his little heart. He's trying so hard. And then I thought we would just take a bowl or something, put it on our table. a little spatula or something. A whisk. Okay. And then we need a piece of wrapping paper as a bonus. Oh. Just put this under Let me see something that sits on a table, something soft, numbers written backwards, tea bag cover. Okay, let's put this stuff on. And we'll add our numbers later. When we're done. on a second. Okay, I had to take a little break. All right, we got that on there. All right, now we're going to put this on here. I think maybe I want to flip it over. No, both sides are okay. I do up. Go find a gift bag for my daughter's birthday present. I wonder if I should use I think I need to use the fabric tech for this. As soon as I figure out what I did with it. Okay. We're going to put this up there. And I think I can use this glue. Because the glue that I just put on there went through.
Okay. Sorry. Nerves, nerves, nerves. We're going to put this right here. I'm trying to multitask. That's what I'm doing. Let's get this glue off of here. I think I need some more of this glue. Okay. right here we're gonna let this go back down hopefully we're gonna put this down here to represent our tablecloth Hang on a second. Did I tell you I was multitasking? Multitasking is taking up all my time. So, back to the project at hand. Okay, we're gonna put this right there. And then, and then, so we've got a repeating pattern, a tea bag cover, or my version of a tea bag cover. Hang on a second. Is that a hit on there? Yes, it is. I'm trying to find my pen for my glue. Got the pin in the glue. All right, we're gonna put this right here. We're gonna put our whisk underneath. And then we just need to do our numbers backwards. So, one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, <laughs> There's our numbers backwards. We're just going to put some up here. 13. 14. 15. 16. 17, 18, 19, there. So I think we have it all. I think I need to trim 
just a little bit off of this edge down here. Yeah. And then I need to hole punch. Get the hole punch out. You know, it's funny. I was cleaning out my closet. And there's this box inside a box in there. So I look in the box. I like stamps. So I've been collecting postage stamps for years, right? So I have all kinds of postage stamps in this office. But there's a box inside a box in my closet and I opened it up and it's from when I was... No, I gave my sister my stamp book, but it was a, you know, a child's stamp book. <laughs> they're everywhere, they're everywhere. All right, we have a repeating pattern tea bag cover, something that sits on a table, something soft, numbers written backwards, and as a bonus wrapping paper. So this is our page for our Marguerite Miller Challenge, week number 48, if in the year 2023. And then next week we'll do that side. So that's going to do it for this video. As always, be safe. Don't let the world change your smile. Let your smile change the world. Until next time, bye.